I'm Peter Gethers, author of My Mother's Kitchen, Breakfast, Lunch, Dinner, and the Meaning of Life. I can narrow it down to two. The first one is when I was 17 years old and went to Paris for the very first time on my own. And the only French person I knew took me to a little bistro, I have no idea the name of it, but I had no idea that food could taste like that. What I remember was probably memorable for her as well, because what she told me afterwards is that she'd never actually heard anyone make noises like that outside of the bedroom. Second was the meal I actually prepared for my mother's memorial, which I write about in the book. It was a combination of the fact that I cooked many things for 65 or 70 people, which is kind of extraordinary, but also because of the emotional connection that I had to all of that food. This is going to sound funny because it's so simple, is chocolate pudding. It had to do with the fact that Louise Trotti, the, the woman who used to make it, uh, would reward me for being good uh, as a young, young boy by letting me lick the wooden spoon that she would run around the pot of warm hot chocolate. And I made it for my mother when my mother was 93 years old. And she, this time around, licked the wooden spoon with warm hot chocolate. And it transported us both back to our relative youths. I think the best pasta I ever tasted was made by Alice Waters at Chez Panisse, which was really simple. It was just pasta and Meyer lemon sauce. And just thinking about it makes me weak need. So I would say it would be pasta, a great espresso, a great red wine, probably a burgundy. No, definitely a burgundy. Uh, and to top it off a Chateau Kim dessert wine. The meaning of life is actually living life as well as possible.